what is true power? Firstly, it is a force for good, the force of clear vision, of clear purpose, of kindness, of expecting the best from others. A force that will confront injustice with wisdom and without violence. True power is not about how much force you can exert over another, it is rather how much force you can exert for another. And this leads me to my next touch point. True power builds with others in mind. It means that others matter in your individual journey through life. If we all adopted this, we wouldn't have to worry about doormats and self-neglect because the operation of empowering and considering others would bring a safety to all our individual souls. True power is inclusive. It's found in the collective. Diversity is strength. See, diversity is actually not about color or gender. It's found different, in differing skill sets, personalities, strengths, weaknesses, nationalities, opinions of view, ways of being. Whether at work or in family or in communities or any arena of life, true power knows that bonded diversity is the glue. True power understands dependency and vulnerability and allows these two dynamics to bring people together and not tear them apart. The true power empowers. It allocates trust alongside accountability. To quote Dominic again, if we are going to be authentic, then let's trust people. Let's trust their abilities, trust in their competence. Don't say you're a leader if you have no investment in the ones you lead. True power is a harness. It harnesses the resources at its disposal to ensure everything I've just mentioned. <laughs> See, money is a tool, not a weapon. Influence is a mechanism, not manipulation. Position and title are an opportunity, not a disco suit. True power asks the question, what is at my disposal to affect everything I have just, that has just been mentioned? What resource can you allocate to play your part in our liberty?